Welcome to the eStrategy webcast. This is uh, David Erickson, your host. Uh, for today's webcast, I want to uh, show you a new feature that Twitter has added. Finally, they've, uh, they're have they offering their users some analytics on their activity on Twitter. They have lagged way behind um, other social uh, sites like Facebook in offering users uh, some glimpse into their own activity on, on the platform. So. Um, this they rolled out, uh, and it's uh, part of the ads, their Twitter advertising platform. And so you need to log into your account uh, at the ads.twitter.com uh, URL. You do not have to advertise. You do not have to be. You do not have to be a current advertiser to uh, see this activity. So you just need to log into that uh, part of uh, uh, Twitter in the ads account. And when you log in, then by default, you will see your timeline activity. And here it is. Um, this is for my account. Um, you can see that over time, it will give you by day a uh, summary of how many mentions you've had, how many followers, how many unfollowers uh, you've had for that particular day. So you can see, uh, get a glimpse over time of, uh, of what your activity has been like. Right? And then it will uh, list recent tweets. Um, so it will individually list the tweets and uh, show you click counts and show you favorites and show you retweets and show you replies, uh, all of them, the best of them, and good ones. Uh, the best of them are uh, the top 15% of tweets with some level of engagement between, uh, between the period in question. Um, and good tweets are uh, shows the top two thirds of tweets with some level of engagement. I'm not quite so sure about some of this click data because because uh, it doesn't match up with uh, with uh, some of my own independent uh, analytics. So uh, I, I don't know how accurate that is. Anyway, uh, it's something. Uh, then you can also download this data in a comma separated value. So that's nice. You can put that in a spreadsheet and examine it that way. And then you also have um, followers analytics. In the followers analytics, this, this goes back from when you first joined Twitter. So you can see your growth in followers uh, over time since uh, the beginning of your activity on Twitter. So that's uh, sort of interesting. Um, uh, so interesting there. Uh, but more interesting is the uh, demographic breakdown of your followers. So my uh, followers are two-thirds male. Uh, one third female um, followers. My uh, people, my my followers also follow. So it gives you a listing of that. Um, the interest, most unique interest. That's the top five most unique interests of your followers. That doesn't really mean. I don't know what unique means in this context. But anyway, uh, not surprisingly, uh, I talk a lot about marketing. So it's 40% uh, marketing, 34% leadership, startups, SEO. Uh, human resources, top interests, the top 10 interests of your followers. So um, I presume this is stuff that comes from their bio, keywords from their bio, but maybe it's stuff they click on. I don't, it doesn't, there's no real good explanation of what the, what this data is, but uh, if they add that, that would be very helpful. <laughs> um, anyway, technology, business, and finance, a lot of stuff that I do talk about, so that makes sense. Uh, geographic locations, uh, of my followers, and I am in Minnesota, so um, Minneapolis, St. Paul is 21% uh, is of my audience, that makes sense, and it has a breakdown visually too, so I can, uh, you can get uh, numbers and percentages of, uh, of your followers uh, in geographic locations, and then, uh, and then international as well. So uh, those are your stats, you can't download this stuff um, uh, in in a comma separated value, but it, it's a beginning. It's uh, something, uh, it's nice to see they're finally taking analytics seriously and, uh, and offering them some analytics to their users. I'd like to see a lot more sophisticated analytics like uh, Facebook offers you, but, uh, or even Google, um, but it's better than nothing. So uh, there you go. Analytics for uh, for uh, Twitter users. This has been a webcast of the strategy. Uh, blog at e-strategyblog.com. My name is David Erickson, your host. You can reach, you can follow me on Twitter at derickson, and of course you can reach me at the e-strategyblog.com. Uh, make sure that you uh, click on the subscribe tab uh, at the top of the blog to uh, subscribe to the email update. Make sure you don't miss any uh, of these uh, webcasts or any other content. Thanks for watching.
Thanks for watching. I'm David Erickson, host of the eStrategy webcasts. I'd love to know what you think, so uh, please leave your thoughts in the comments below. And uh, if you like this video, be sure to press the thumbs up button and share the video with your uh, with your social networks. And of course, uh, subscribe to the eStrategy YouTube channel. Uh, you will get uh, my weekly Beyond Social Media video podcast. You'll get marketing, advertising, public relations, online case studies. Uh, you get trend analysis, interviews, and uh, demonstrations of super cool tools. So be sure to subscribe to the eStrategy YouTube channel. Thanks a lot.